Victoria, I'm 21 and I think I should be a Blue Peters presenter because... I'm creative and friendly and willing to give anything a go. Right now I'm going to show you how to decorate cake pops like these ones at the front. When you get the cakes out of their mould from the oven, they'll be shaped like this in little balls. To get the stick to stick like this, you get a lolly stick and you get one of your cake balls and then you have to dip the stick in the icing so that the end's nice and covered like that. And then you just push it into the cake about halfway and then leave it in its packet to set so that the icing will act a bit like glue and the stick won't slip around. And this one is one that I prepared earlier that's nice and solid on its stick like you can see. And to decorate it, I'm just going to get a bit of icing and you can do it however you want. I'm just going to spread it on top like that. And you can use any kind of decoration you want once you put the icing on. I've got some nice wafer daisies like these ones that are nice and summery. But I'm going to use these yellow sprinkles because they're nice and bright and they're very eastery. So you just take the icing and you dip it into your bowl until it's all nice and covered in the yellow sprinkles, like so. And that is your cake pop ready for eating. Okay, so as Easter's coming up, I've got Lewis, Dr Chicken, here to tell us about rabbits and chicks. So Lewis, how many chickens do you actually have and how long have you had them for? Uh, so I've had chickens for seven years, I've got 20 in my back garden, uh, I've also got a duck and they all live happily together. <laughs> and what's your favourite chicken called? Uh, my favourite chicken's called Mabel and she's a Pekin Bantam. And to hatch chickens, how do you actually hatch a, a chick? Uh, chickens take 21 days to hatch and the mother chicken will sit on the eggs to keep them warm at 37.6 degrees. Uh, she turns them three times a day to make sure the chicks don't get stuck inside their eggs and then the chicks will hatch and the mother will raise them. And what if there isn't a mother hen? Can you hatch the chickens yourself? If you haven't got a mother hen you can use an incubator to hatch them. Uh, you turn them yourself three times a day for 21 days. And you brought a few things in to show us, and as you said before, you've got Elvis, and he's a quail, did you say? Elvis is a Japanese quail. Um, Elvis is a she, and she's four weeks old, and she's nearly up to maturity. And are all the quail, like, the same colour, or do you get different coloured ones? Uh, so this is a tuxedo range, so he's brown and white. Uh, the others are just brown, and you can get some blonde ones. And you've also got Sherlock the rabbit, haven't you? Sherlock is a dwarf lot. Uh, he's two years old and he's a house rabbit.